Awesome. So, you know, obviously after the Staley game, it seems like you guys have really picked up a rhythm and got things going. What do you feel like changed after that game? Would you see improve? Well, we learned a lot from the Staley game. I mean, we were, you know, a little unsure of our identity going in and, um, you know, we, 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 we played pretty well. We just kind of made some mistakes and, you know, coaches kind of, uh, you know, we kind of panicked a little bit in some situations and got away from what we were trying to do, and that kind of hurt. And so that was our focus, you know, over the last three weeks is continue to get better at what we do. Get, you know, keep grinding and doing what we do. And I think that's where we've shown our success. You know, we've played really well over the last three weeks because we've done some good things. Um, that and and I think that's making us better as a team because you know, we're just continuing to get better at how we do things instead of trying to change things week to week. Um, we're just trying to make sure that we're solid in, in, in what we're trying to accomplish. You know, it seems like when you look at this offense, I feel like they've really found kind of an identity, you know, when you look at Nathan Dent, but a lot of the talk has been surrounding Nathan Dent, but you know, who else on this offense have you seen step up and kind of be a playmaker this year? Well, they all stepped up. I mean, we don't, you know, we, we don't have like, the, you know, Peyton Messer wide receiver is definitely a big playmaker for us, but you know, what we have is we have a lot of guys that can, can do some good things and get positive yards. We know that our office isn't designed around, you know, backs that can break for 99 yards. We just don't have that. Um, I would, I'd like to see it happen, but, um, but what we do, you know, our, our identity is, you know, to move the chains, you know, keep our defense off the field, keep moving the football and then the big plays come. And I think that's where we've gotten better as a team is that we're, we're able to, you know, control the clock a little bit and have possession of the ball. So, but, you know, that's where we've been successful with. Um, and then when the big plays happen, we know, you know, when it gets in Nate's hands, he can do a lot of good things. So again, it's just one of those things where, we just got to go with it. And sometimes we cringe when he does some of the things he does. And sometimes we get fist bumps, you know, so, um, but that's kind of where our offense is at. And, and I think the direction, I think we've gone the right direction, but, you know, we'll find out, you know, we'll find out tomorrow night because, you know, like I said, you know, we got it. We're going up against a good football team and, and we got to see, you know, if we progress through the week, which I think we've done some good things, um, but that's kind of where we're at. You know, Helias always a tough game. Uh, what, what are you guys looking at for Helias this year? A lot of new guys on that team as well. Sure. I mean, you know, I mean, a lot of questions have been asked, you know, how, you know, after last year, da, 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 you know, and they won the state championship. And, and I'll be the first one to tell you, I walked off that game last year saying if they're not playing the state championship, then something's wrong because they were a solid, solid football player with some our football team with some really, really good football players. Um, and this year, say, you know, they're solid again, um, really good football players. Um, but again, a lot like us, a lot of guys that didn't have a played, you know, in the limelight and big games like this. So, you know, very similar, but they do a great job. I mean, they're the kids they've got playing, you know, they're very disciplined. Um, they're well coached um, and, and they don't make a lot of mistakes and they do what they do kind of like how we are. Um, and we just got to continue to, you know, make sure we're prepared for that and, and full well knowing that, you know, if we stop one thing, I, I guarantee you they've got something else because they are well coached. And, and, and so, you know, we've prepared that way to be able to make adjustments, but nothing different, nothing really is changing. It's just making adjustments to how they line up and what they do. Well, you know, you kind of answered the question a little bit, but Halaya is an offense that can really put up points very quickly. If you let them, you know, how much of an emphasis have you guys put like on that defensive end this week or is it kind of business as usual, treat it, you know, as normal. Well, our weakness all year, we knew that going in, was was kind of in our secondary and getting, you know, the big play has killed us. Um, you know, not a lot of teams have driven down the field on us. And I'm not saying that they haven't because there's been a couple of series they have. But for the most part, it's the big plays. It's the explosive plays that have put us in a bind. You know, you look at last week. I mean, we were playing well, but it was a big run to the outside um, for, you know, about a 60-yard run. And then, a, you know, a, a fade ball down to the one-yard line. I mean, take those two plays away, you know, we might have had a shutout. So, again, it goes back to, you know, big plays have been a factor on us, our defense all year. Otherwise, you know, we do a pretty good job and, and we make some things happen so you know, our focus is we made some personal changes we did it last week a little bit um still kind of a couple of things this week um the big thing for us is stopping the outside run and stopping the you know stopping the, the deep balls the big plays and i think if we can do that we'll put ourselves in good situations so you know our focus is we want to make them drive and feel we want to make them put put the ball snap the ball 12 15 times and score and, and if they can do that then you know what they, they deserve to get what they get so but we just got to stop the big plays defensively. That, that, that's the key for us. Well, I appreciate your time, Coach. I'll let you get on to the rest of your day. <laughs> yeah, well, I get to go teach classes yeah. and then get ready to roll. So it never <laughs> stops. But, Natalie, I appreciate you. I apologize. 
as I my my schedule gets all <laughs> no problem. Up. I, I totally work, understand. But, I totally uh, understand. Have a good all one. Right. All right, appreciate you. You Thanks. too. Bye bye.